It's the only girl. Uh, unfortunately, it's too late for that at the moment. I'm gonna. Fair enough. I'm gonna find out in the break between the maps. Let's do that. We're starting off, guys. It's Chronic versus Pavel here on the 125 FPS melee group D2. I'm starting us up on Chronic. He's got a uh, mega side all to himself. Yeah, and it's a typical start. This is for this for this map. More typical than uh, Chronic versus Sparty. Exactly. Uh... This is what I can understand. <laughs> hmm. Chronic's still and moving in, although taking a rail anyway. He's got to be careful here, because he surely shouldn't be able to challenge on this, but his LG damage is substantial. Nice dodging of the rockets. He uses, used the pillars very nicely. Yeah, no, I'm impressed by Chronic that he actually didn't die just then, because usually when you take a rail before red, you're like, yeah. alright, I forfeit that position yeah. completely. But also, Pavel's rockets weren't very good. Mm -hmm. So, so yeah, nice rail. He's done it t twice now, actually. He hit him in the rail when he was in the Mega Room, and he's hit him in the rail in red. And now both the major items are spawning at the same time. I think Chronic is actually looking really good in the next 15 seconds. Hits a direct even. Things are getting better. Yeah, this is nice. Makes you kind of think about that Sparty game a couple of minutes ago, right? Does it? Yeah. I mean, the rail. It's like the other way around. This this time it's chronic yeah. hitting the annoying rails, not Sparty, of course. I'm thinking more <laughs> about about the level of the players because Pavel is no pushover. Uh, if chronic anything, is dealing with you better than 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 he did with Sparty, in my opinion. Even though Sparty made like that, in my opinion, mistake at the beginning. <clears throat> I think actually it'll be more impressive if Chronic beats Pavel now if, than if he beats Sparty, I think. Well, he didn't beat Sparty, so we already know that. Yeah, so I, I'll be actually shocked. Let's, let's put it that way if he, if he does manage okay, to beat Pavel. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> he takes uh, some annoying grenade damage just then. Pavel should be able to get himself on Mega, but he's slow. He's going to drop down. That's not where you want to be, Pavel. we got to jump over. Chronic doesn't mind taking that rail damage. He's, oh, no, he's going to charge. Go to red. You need to get to red quickly, Chronic. This is you. You deserve it. But actually, Pavel, he's there too fast. Can he survive at all? It's a pretty nasty route. Oh my God, Chronic though suddenly takes a shed load of damage himself. Yeah, now Pavel he's weaker. deals. Pavel doing some some nasty damage to Chronic <laughs> and a facial rocket to the face. Facial rocket to the face. That's R.I.P. in peace. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, but yeah, Pavel is showing right now what he's made of, as you said earlier, and it's not kittens and fluff. Fluff? At the moment. Ooh. There's a really dense piece of fluff just hit Pavel. Oh yeah, yeah, very dense. How many facial rockets did we see just in the last hour today? Two lot, telefrags, 20 well. facial rockets. Well, that's what we expect for our, at this level, I think. That's what we, we should we, be expecting. We, we should be getting lots of direct rockets. Yeah. Unfortunately, that's not always the case. <laughs> we got like the... Tons of damage, like Chronix oh. rockets and rail, it's like to the point. No bullshit, just get not messing around. around. Yeah, exactly. He's gonna find another kill over here. Pavel's gonna drop down again. Fortunately, he doesn't go back up the bounce pad. Oh, Chronic the weapon switch! He goes for the flick, but forces Pavel to kill himself. Switching to rail in the wake of Pavel's rockets in defense wasn't the best decision Chronic could, could have made in that decision. At least, at least he managed to get in his face. If he didn't force the mutual frag, I think he would have been pretty upset. And he, he just kind of walks out of the room and is like, Okay, Pavel, that's the Mega. Take it. Enjoy. <laughs> And Pavel's like, Spasibo. <laughs> Thank you, please. <laughs> oh, Chronic has got himself the red. Can he get out of the room okay? We see some more of those Irish rockets. Oh, he's, he's, keeping, he's keeping it tense right now. He doesn't want to give us too much all at once. Yeah, and it's uh, and it's a slow match right now. We're almost uh, at the half point of the game, and it's still only two to one. And there's not much switching of control. Players just keep their status quo at the moment. What health and armor is Chronic on? He's uh, 100 to 100. Yeah, it's it's tight as hell at the moment. Yeah. 
I mean, they're exchanging the damage, but they aren't in 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 their faces all all, all, all out. Pavel at the moment's got position on this red, but he's very early for it. Chronic has had time to get himself a different position. And he actually... unmistakably hits that rail from above. Yeah. It's only one rail though, I don't feel like it was very oh, you know, scary for Pavel at all. He needed to hit an, at least another one to knock him off. Or knock his oh, is going. Okay. Pavel is uh, allied with Chronic right now and is helping him take himself down. Oh my nice. god, the algae. To the absolute maximum, but suddenly the rail. Oh, Ooh, come on, kill him, man. What's red. up? Yeah. But close. <laughs> Way closer than Pavel would have wanted. Oh my god, can he get the kill? Four health left for Pavel. Cherishing that position here behind the pillar. This is Chronic, though, gonna take Mega. He's had the yellow. He might make his way over to the lower yellow as well. But he doesn't want to. He, sh he should know that Pavel is just crumbling apart. Yeah, he has to know that. Did you just, no, he was in the rail room, okay. I'm watching Pavel at the moment, curious uh, to yeah, see same. how he's gonna play it, because he's very, very low at the moment. It's almost available. All, all of the items. Now Red and Mega up at the yeah. same time, Chronic wants a kill immediately. Otherwise, Pavel's probably gonna be able to step on one of them, and he's heading towards the... Okay, that's a great rail. Chronic might be able to secure two big items. Uh oh. Is he gonna be able to make it back in, in time? And Pavel steals the mega health. I mean, it's okay still for Chronic because Pavel is essentially at starting yeah, stack at the moment. Stack. Yeah. Ooh. That jump wasn't as easy as it looked. Still winding him down with those rails, instantly, uh, constantly railing him from weird positions. I mean, not necessarily weird positions, but constant railage onto Pavel. He can't get catch a break. Though. Pavel just managed to hit the jackpot, get two yellow armors in a row. Now, look, he's suddenly gone from being really defensive to actually, I'm alert, is pricked up, let's do a little bit of damage. He might be well, able to hold off to this red. He didn't do any, and uh, Chronic obviously hit the rail. <laughs> and he wins himself a red armor. If he didn't hit the rail, though, Shoot, at least. then Pavel probably would have been able to get that uh, that red himself. Yeah. Yeah. There's a long That's title items. And I'm going to watch Chronic a bit. It's been really interesting following Pavel, actually playing defensively. But I, I really want to see Chronic get back into this, because he's, mm. he's been working hard to maintain this control. And but I feel annoyed, like going back and forth on items. I feel like even though Chronic is uh, in control, I still think like Pavel, Pavel is dictating the pace of the match. Yeah. Uh, he keeps it slow, and Chronic has nothing to answer, and he can't. Well, right now he finds him, and he can't resolve in a fracture. Oh Chronic, my yeah. god, that was expensive though for Chronic getting that kill. Very expensive. He's... Getting, he's gonna get the 50 health bubble. He would really like this red armor freely. And now I think he's just gonna have to go over to Mega. Can't BS around and go over to uh, the, the rail. And this time he misses. That's unfortunate. But there's plenty of time and he doesn't have to rush. He can easily uh, wait another item rotation and check if Bubble will make a mistake. Oh. And he does. He actually gets it done pretty quickly. He managed yeah. to hit the rocket. I think Pavel was like funking around. I don't know what business he was doing. I heard him like rocketing himself down at the bottom. And uh, now this is an extremely tight game. Not that it wasn't earlier. And Chronic, he's looking to take the lead at the moment. He's got to watch out for these grenades flying up into the air. Oh, awesome rail. This is going to allow him to get another kill, but he wants to finish it with the railgun. Surely Switch eventually comes out. I think oh. he just let Pavel go there with this stupid Switch to rail. <laughs> And he what eats a, a, a nade. Oh man. And That's... loses the right. <laughs> no way, that grenade decided so much just then, but Chronic, he's still fighting strong with these rails. That one was definitely not as painful as, uh, as the last. He lost everything with that unfortunate switch. Shotgun would probably kill Pavel there. He's gonna drop, have a look. He wants to get this red. They might have to make a gentleman's agreement here and. Have a yeah. switch up on the, the major items. No, There's no, Mega, Pavel but... is setting Ooh. a trap, but it's too late. This is bad for what? Pavel, though, because all of a sudden, Chronic, he can actually get the last frag, and now he doesn't matter if he is left with no health at all. 
He can just absolutely go for it. Paolo goes through the teleporter, risks being taken by Chronic. Is this going to be something he regrets? Because it, it maybe will. And all of a sudden, he just gets out of there. No, thank yeah, you. It's very low. Nothing, nothing to look for in that fight for him anymore. So we have a first overtime. This is good. But Chronic realized that, hey, I can go for the kill. It doesn't matter if I come out the other end of 10 health, as long as I get the kill. But yeah. he didn't. And he was left with, like, no health anyway, so it was actually a very, very tense for him just then. Oh, actually, Pavel misses the rail shot. That's a happy sight for Chronic. What's his ping, baby? 48? Where are they playing? In Russia? Sweden. Sweden? Oh, that's true. Oh, man, I forget so many I know, so I'm not lying things. to you. Oh, no, 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 I, 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 no. <laughs> I saw the conversation, I just totally, like, erased it from my, my memory already. Ooh, this is interesting what just happened. Pavel went down to the lower yellow and... Oh, Chronic misses the jump over! Okay, that was almost epic for him, but all of a sudden, maybe Pavel's gonna be able to get this kill. There's not much health left, but he hits the direct rocket. 14 health left. Pavel, is he going to back away? 11 HP. The rails are missing, though, from the Irish player. He is going to get away, but has Pavel stopped yet? <laughs> Now Chronic can breathe, but not for long. There's 45 seconds left in this overtime, and Powell has overwhelming control. Yeah, and Chronic is being a victim of a trend today, of being uh, railed or rocketed from the Mega just before it spawns. Because yeah, Sparty did the so... same. Oh, well, direct rocket, but Powell chasing him down. There's 30 seconds left. Powell has acquired the kill that could win him the first map in this best of three. Now Chronic... I'm sorry, man, you've not got many resources, but you've got to get a kill somehow. He got the mega health. Can he make it win? No, he can't. That's going to no, be never. game. That yeah, was really shit. close game. Now. Very nice match. Very close and competent. It was, no, it was an excellent game. Just uh, well yeah. played there to Pavel for, for taking him out. Let's uh, switch those scores up. I guess, like, the only one thing that stands out for me towards the end that may be currently mm. is instead of going for that kind of desperation mode, let's go get the frag before overtime, maybe he could have just been like, all right, I'll accept that we're getting an overtime uh, that is on its way. And he maybe would have been able to hold on to the control a little easier and just turtle the game out a bit. Yeah, well, Still. that's the thing. He, he he gave it all in uh, the not very opportune moment, and he was in disadvantage at the at the beginning of the overtime. Mm -hmm. And uh, also that uh, that switch to rail uh, in the last uh, two minutes, uh, which let Pavel go, uh, cost him all the items, and actually gave Pavel a, a chance to repel him. Yeah. Let's have a look though. We're going on to the next map. It is going to be Sinister. This would be a map that Pavel uh, would have picked up, but I'm checking out Chronic to begin with. Yep. And he had a uh, red spawn. Looks pretty even at the moment. He's going to be happy to have all the weapons in the first 12 seconds. And he can maybe yeah, that's try. His, and... That's his advantage at the moment. Weapons. And, and he makes a uh, nice use of it right away. He's got to watch out for these grenades, they've been a curse for him on uh, Furious Heights. But it's actually looking really good for Chronic. He definitely wants to secure this Mega Health. It's gonna be a fight for the Mega, probably. Oh, Papa was there. He's just hoping to get a bit of free damage over here, but actually getting yeah. nothing. Havel's probably gonna be near 100, 200 with... Lots of yellows He's and stuff. He's 100, 100 actually. At the oh really? Only, only that? I thought he would have been able to keep a bit more armor. No, Chronic is getting the, the, the bulk of the items at the moment. Oh, this is this is good uh, stuff then. But he wants to get yeah. a kill soon. He doesn't want to let Pavel get to 100, This is, this is the perfect moment. He has twice the stack as Pavel does. And if he doesn't push at the moment, so Pavel, he knows where he is. If he doesn't mm -hmm. push right now after the mega health, I think it may be a uh, missed opportunity for him. And now. That's good. Go. Yeah. Cracking stuff, right? He's just going to get the other yellow, I think. Yep, that's everything taken by Chronic, and he's actually got enough time to get yeah. red without any in, uh, disturbances. He can go straight to Mega. 
Don't you think it's a kind of uh, type of situation that uh, that demon falls uh, victim to, taking the items uh, when the uh, opportunity to get a frag arises? I mean, it almost. I don't think that the frag opportunity has actually been as abundantly like as evidently mm -hmm. clear that it's yeah, there as, as it has been for demon in the past. But we'll we'll see. Maybe he will suffer the same yeah same problems. Well, he's pushing around now. He's found a, he's found an opportunity. He's like, I got 200, 200. I might as well use it. And does pretty pretty decent damage. Falls back to the red, and he's very very okay and comfortable at the moment for the mega hope. Yeah, he's really calculating how much time he has to the second to sneak around these corridors. Although, actually, Pavel lands the rail on him. And Chronic's having to be a bit careful. Yeah, Chronic is still 100 collective, half an armor ahead. So Pavel still needs to hit a nice, decent rocket or, or a rail to even out the stacks. Oh! <laughs> And that's that's exactly. a nasty rocket to take. And another, okay. This is a happy time for Chronic at the moment. That yellow's still up. Is he gonna go? He he does actually move in. Mega's up, he's got a second uh, left. But Pavel, oh, the rail lands! Can you spell clutch right there? Chronic is going to take the lead. But immediately off the spawn, Pavel has got, has been granted a fantastic spawn from the heavens. And it's another slow, sinister game. For us. I, I quite like a slow, sinister, you know? I, I, oh, I like it because so I can I see think. the thought process going through, you know? It's not just like mindless rushing or, hey, I'm going to invest lots of frags and try to air walk it up over here. Oh, but we've got to move on the Mega. Chronic does not want to forfeit this item. He's got 200 health. Oh, he can't land the rail. That was a beautiful shot from Pavel. Yeah, I didn't even hit him on my screen, and he somehow got an angle. He just zipped by and, and hit it. Yeah. It was awesome. But I got the LG move here from Chronic. Actually, he does some good work over there. He's going to have to defend this teleporter. Uh, yeah, and I think that he moved away in the very, very good moment. He did his job. Let's not risk the lead. Go away. Yeah, he's gonna, he's gonna be loving and caring for this lead as much as yeah. possible. He has a nice rotation, he's in time for red, he doesn't need to push uh, too much, uh, especially as he knows that Papa would hit those damn rockets. And if you only overextend yourself, you're in big trouble. Yeah, I, I feel like it's gonna maybe come to that point where as the tension rises in this game, yeah. Pavel's gonna... You know, have a better and better plan, and Chronic might suffer a little bit. I don't know, I think... Uh, I, I would think that Pavel's plan would be, like, make no mistakes and play defensively and not lose more frags and just fight in the opportune moment. And, uh... I, feel, I just feel that Pavel's gonna have the advantage towards yeah. the end, just because I feel like he's less vulnerable to the nerves. Yeah, Chronic. that's what I was trying to say. Exactly, exactly the point I, I, I would have made. Mm -hmm. uh, Right now I see Pavel as as more on top of things when it comes to competitive play. Yes. Plays every league, every tournament. He knows how to behave. No, oh, exactly. Not not that Chronic's a scrub at all. He's definitely had his share of experience, but not so much in the top top of the top top in Quake Live. Pretty nasty damage done by Pavel, but Chronic is going to be able to get over to top yellow directly to a red setup. He's just got to watch out for these grenades. He's had a, his fair share of experience with Pavel's grenades and he doesn't want to reenact them. Oh, this looks like it's 200-200. I, I want Chronic to start capitalizing from this. He's got a one frag lead. Lovely, great, you're in the lead, Chronic, but you need a little bit more than that. That's it. That might be it. He can drop down. This is absolutely fine for him to do that. He's got the LG 100-100. will serve him just fine. But he needs to find a way to get over to the red armor, and he's super slow about it. Pavel is going to get it. I feel like Pavel might be earning himself a small advantage in this really soon. Oh, we got the yellow up. Oh, Chronic is desperate for survival at the moment. Pavel, his LG is brilliant. 
Now Connick somehow manages to crawl away from this, but now that one frag lead is... It's basically looking like a lead for Pavel. But then the items, they get switched around. This is very unusual, this game. Chronic is managing to keep himself alive, and he's just as understanding of when all the items are up seems to help him massively. He's playing on the defense, though, hardcore. Uh-oh. Kronik, he made the move on the red. He's got to win this fight, otherwise it's not going to be a, a, worth it. Rocket lands and Kronik keeps his lead going. This is beautiful. There's two seconds left for Mega. He's going to go onto it. Surely, no? Ah, that might have been actually a genius move. I did not hear how close to him Pavel actually was just then. Kronik, though, your lead is way too fragile. You've got to get out of here. This is not a good place to be. Leave, man. Can he take this to the tiebreaker and put the pressure more so on Pavel? Look at that, and he just wants to leave, bye bye. He managed to get off that, it sometimes can be very difficult to do. Oh, but he's found him again, get out of that, Rail is gonna miss. Pavel, is he gonna be able to chase? There's gonna be the mega for Pavel? He takes the lower yellow, but Chronic is gonna get the red. And that would have been just a couple of seconds there where Chronic would have had both his fingers crossed in his mind, praying that he's going to be able to get that. Kosil, are you with me at all? Well, you just got thrown oh, off uh, your yes, terrible yes, internet. Yes, 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 excuse me, my headset just betrayed me. Betrayed my trust. I that's don't know what I got muted, to, so excuse me. That's okay, that's okay. It's been a very interesting past couple of minutes. Yeah, maybe, maybe we have uh, actually uh, avoided some stupid, you know. Uh, coming out of my mouth, so let's count our blessings. <laughs> <laughs> Chronic, he might be able to do this. He's had an exceptional defensive game, just being able to get away from every trap that Pavel's trying to pull. And it's just a... Yeah, and it's getting very, very late for Pavel. Mm -hmm. And not like he has a superior red line he does, but it's very, very close. Chronic is still 100, 200, and uh -oh. it's fight. That might have been the best teleporter usage that Pavel's ever had. The 50 health order is taken. Chronic sneaks away with 16 health. He's actually going to defend and gets the kill. That's going to be GG, surely. He's the Probably. mega. And Chronic's like, screw it. I don't care about the kill. If you hit three rails in a row and I suddenly hit 20% LG, I'm not even risking that. Chronic has pulled it off, I think. Yeah, yep. it looked like. Bam. We are getting... Gifted Decent some matches. epic yeah. games. It's, it's only a shame that I'm here to comment on them. But... You're, doing, you're doing a fine job, sir. It's the last Thank time you. I'm ever calling you, sir. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> but not necessarily. Let's see about that. Uh, I completely forgot to ask about the maps, so whatever. <laughs> don't worry about the map. We're going to find out no, I'm not. what it's going to be. It's Battle Forged. Ooh. Alright. Chronic's pretty decent here. Okay. This guy's gonna get set up in a second. Yeah. Uh. Are you enjoying yourself, some Battle Forged? Uh, am I enjoying Battle Forged? It's okay. Yeah. It's been nice to actually see it a couple of times, I guess. Well, let, let, let's yeah. push into the game. I'm I'm not I'm not arguing with it. It's nice to see something fresh from time to time. Oh, Chronic's no. getting red spawn. I'm gonna check out Pavel quickly. Looks like he got the rail immediately. <laughs> Who's gonna win the race to the yellow? Oh, definitely not Chronic by the looks of it, unless he can somehow pull off some sick LG, which is not to be the case. Early first blood for Pavel. Very patient rockets by Pavel. Uh, and actually, I don't know if I have ever seen Pavel playing this map, ever. I, I, I'm not sure. I've seen so many people playing so many maps. I wouldn't yeah. be surprised if I've if I seen Pavel play this, and maybe even at the Battleforge Cup. It's, uh... It gets blurry. Was there? Oh yeah, I, there was a Battleforge Cup. Yeah. It was not so long ago. As well. Exactly. Yeah. All right. So let's. It, yeah, it is blurry once on. you've seen about <laughs> five thousand, ten thousand quick duel games. <laughs> if I were to count them, oh my god, I don't even know how. I wonder many how many have we streamed since the since the last year. 
<laughs> That's a, actually a good question. How many maps have we streamed? We've got in excess of a thousand. Uh, yeah, but thousand votes, not maps. True, true, actually. That might be right. like 3,000 plus maps then. Yeah. Or more. <laughs> That's a lot of maps. Yeah. <laughs> Holy crap. It just occurred to me I watched a lot of Quake. Yeah. <laughs> we all do. But maybe, yeah, we have oh, kind of a game going on and. It's 2 0 for Pavel at the moment. And he's been having full control and taking, like, everything. Mm. Chronic, Chronic's kind of screwed at the moment. He needs to somehow find some crazy damage output. One rail's gonna be helpful, but really, he's not looking for really another yet. one. Is he? Yes, I mean, he wants to. Where's he gonna spawn, though? He might be able to get himself the mega health. Nope. Oh, he actually gets red. I think Pavel may have misread the spawns a little bit, and he sees that the red's not up, so he's gonna have a guesstimate at when it was taken. That it may have taken three frags to lose for Chronic, but he's finally actually found an inch of control that he needs. Yeah, a little bit of footing. And actually, that rail landing as well is, is excellent for him. He's got the, the trail LG. Is gonna be... Excuse me. The trail is gonna be his best friend, by the way. Cause... Not that rocket, though. No. The rocket is gonna be like the arch enemy of the rail. We should make like a twirl. comic strip for them. Yeah, twirl its mustache a little bit, you know? <laughs> gonna have a French accent. <laughs> Why are the French people rail. always evil? I don't know. It's just that's. That's not cool. But they mean oh. it's, it's very cool. Pavel's rail is kicking ass at the moment. Chronic, can he get away? No, he just could not afford to take that 160 damage. That that hurt a lot. Yeah, it must have. But Pavel is on starting stack at the moment, so if Chronic manages to get himself, he gets a yellow. Is he gonna get mega? And he does. Will he? He does. Yeah. So Excellent. this is his chance. Yep. I will say uh. I'm rooting for Chronic just because I always support an underdog. But he is the underdog. I, I'd give him only maybe a 30% chance to win this map versus Pavel. Mm -hmm. He is very much an maybe underdog, 35. but... I don't know. Uh, sometimes I feel that our predictions are... Yes, because last week uh, I wouldn't say Chronic can beat Pavel. And after the last map I would say that he can. Well, he did. Never know. <laughs> <laughs> he yeah. did beat Chronic, there's yeah, no argument. he did, obviously. But even after the, the, the previous one that we lost, it wasn't like right. a massacre. It's not so much of a prediction that I'm laying down. I'm laying down like mm -hmm. what I think the odds the are. Feeling. Yep. So... You know, if yeah. it's like a 30% chance and he wins, it doesn't mean it wasn't a 30% chance. It just means that he overcame the odds. Yeah. <sighs> That's deep, man. <laughs> oh, man. Playing Probability it. theory in full swing. Oh, damn right. They've been playing it pretty slowly, though. Pavel's taking his yeah. time. Oh, Pavel misses his jump, and that's actually going to allow Chronic to get the red music to his ears. Oh, yeah. Are you watching Chronic at the moment? I'm watching Pavel, actually. But I'm going to so switch good. over to Chronic. Let's right? switch to through. Chronic, right? Let's do it. Come on, Chronic. He's actually on 100, 160, so it's decent. This is going to be annoying that much. for Chronic if he doesn't win. Going, actually, wait, let's, we've got a big fight at the moment. Chronic can't really commit. Is Pavel going to come in for this mega? Yes, he is. LG, though, from Chronic's actually been really solid. He can't hit the rail, but he doesn't take any additional damage himself. Yeah, uh, I can say I feel Pavel won that situation at all. What health does Pavel have now, though? Oh, hang on, let's have a look. We've still got five seconds left until this red. The rail can't land from Chronic. But how much health did he have left? Sorry. 25. Yeah, well, that would have been a kill then. Yes. Yeah. So maybe this situation was won by Chronic down when he was at Mega. I think he hit enough LG to grant I him mean, the situation could have been won by him just a second ago when he could have killed Pavel. Yeah. Mega's up, Chronic. The Mega is there. Oh, he spots it. It's like, alright, oh, I better take you before that red spawns. What is, is that blue thing right there? Maybe I should take it. 
All right, so actually, Chronic hasn't got a frag yet, but he has got all of the items. This oh, they're gonna meet each other in the air. Synchronized bounce pad, well, nice. jumps, and he clears it out. All right, Powell is in a colossal amount of trouble. It's a nice little move there by Chronic. I love how he read that situation. That's two to four. Is that and it? And picking up frags very, 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 very quickly after a long stretch of uh, Powell's defensive game. So the Mega's up. Hamill's actually going to drop down it. Oh, he even gets the, the Mega. Chronic goes for an optimistic rail. Yeah, but Chronic is oh. still stuck in Pavo two, twice, so... Yeah, that rail at the end that he landed it, it was particularly juicy. He's guarding the 50. Oh, he just switched weapons! If he didn't switch, that could have been a golden rail for him. He's just got to be completely focused right now. He cannot be jittery at all. Nope. And he can't take these uh, unnecessary rails where at least he's not responding any kind of damage. We're going to have Yellow surely go through the teleporter. No. The Mega's up. He wants to take a different route. And now he's going to have to rocket jump somehow to get to the red armor. But he's out positioned. It was looking good for Chronic, but not so much anymore. Yeah, but again, that rail. And they're very even at the moment. So it's anyone's game uh, when it comes to control. But Pavel's still in the lead, of course. Mm -hmm. And but yeah, Chronic stacking up. It's not like at the beginning of the match when Pavel wasn't giving him anything. So uh, right now, uh, Chronic has opportunities. He just has to take full advantage of them before the time runs out. Chronic might have to give up this mega. Yep, and he's got himself a, a load more armor, but he has to win a fight, and he has to win the fight with some decent amount of help. So he can continue his control. Yellow up on the side. He doesn't want to get baited out onto it. And actually, Pavel takes the jump pad. Oh my god, I can't believe Christ missed that rail. He's missed the second one as well. Is Pavel going to survive? Oh, he's got 5 HP. 5 HP. <laughs> no. I just wanted to say that they're both running on fumes, but yeah. right about then, Pavel took matters in his own hands and... One might say he finished the job. I think so, to be honest. There's still 90 seconds left. It, it's now a huge task for Chronix to come back in this. Yeah. And Pavel, though, still paying him respects. Not doing anything that's too, um, too risky for the time being. But he's going to just pick up a frag when he's got the opportunity right in front of his eyes. He's not going to say no to it. He wants to end that game as soon as possible, ideally, in the safest manner possible. And well I won the win. Chronic wasn't an easy opponent. Very well played. Man, we have only nice games today. I, I like it a lot, to be honest. Yeah. It is sweet. Yeah, because there are days when it's just dire and you just want to die. <laughs> like when in space. <laughs> you just want to crawl into a corner and rot. O occasionally the a little gem comes out. He, he lives up to... Uh, what should be his normal standards, at least. Yeah. Should be. But, um, Chronic, I feel I feel bad for him, because he's come really close to beating Sparty in the best of yep. three. Takes a map, can't swing the tiebreaker into his own hands. And the same's happened to Pavel. He's had a really awesome series. I hope he's able to win some more games, but he's got Winter Particle and Seven to go against, who are extremely tough opponents. This is, this is, a, this is a hard day for uh, everyone. Yeah, and this GG. is actually the stage when the group, when the league actually gets interesting because obviously the earlier stages, GG obviously, well played, mm -hmm. but we already talked about it. So the league gets really interesting in that second group stage because it's only good players and it's, sometimes it happens to get crappy games, but all in all it's like very cool mm -hmm. week. And the next week, apart from final, which is 